Well, hello everyone. It's your buddy Charles Thunder, aka Chuck, and we are sailing to northern France in Uncharted Waters Online. We uh, just begun a journey from Lisbon, Spain, or Portugal to get to uh, northern France to start making some food for us. Uh, we've been using mostly this cassoulet uh, food, it only gives me plus 20 vigor and that means 11 of the uses to refill so I'm gonna use these up but I would like to use a better food and we're gonna be using our new food we just got from the Makeable Meats book we're gonna get in the process of making right here we're gonna make pork and apple saute should be better I don't know what it gives but hopefully more than 20 vigor per use that would be the goal um, but in the meantime this will do um, I don't even attempt to use a couple of them now just to stock up on the vigor uh, but this is what we're doing today we're sailing sailing to get to where we need to be um, and then I, my overall goal in the next coming days is to get my character level to level 20 in trade so I have to do some like longer trips soon Man, while I'm up here in the northern region I might go to like do some port hopping get some things to get my adventure skill up and uh, I'll trade along the way get this uh, leveling skill and earn some money and if it comes down to it if I have to I'll just break the bank a little bit and buy some East India or East Asian goods uh, in Seville or Lisbon and just trade them right to the market keeper to get some of that uh, experience. So here we are sailing away. You know, I, I always wanted to play this game and stream it, um, but I don't know if my computer can handle streaming or if I have the right streaming uh, settings. Uh, I'll have to have somebody one day tell me how the stream is going, if it's clean, choppy, clear. Um, high FPS or not and then make some adjustments um, so that it works out right if it doesn't you know it's no big deal I like posting these videos instead um, I may not get a lot of views for because this is a rather niche game but it is definitely one in which that I wanted to uh, you know get started with maybe easily doing a let's play on um, I didn't start this game off anew for you guys and if that's something that strikes you we want to see me play a player character right from the beginning rather than being you know generally halfway started like I am now like I've just about to finish school you know then that's fine I can do that separately on another let's play video at some point um, but right now the, just wanted to continue off with a character who's relatively early on um, and he, he, really nothing too crazy has happened like literally all I've done up to this point is just go through school do a few trades maybe a couple event quests that are early on in the game travel up to northern Europe here once or twice just to uh, and do a couple quests of trading and that's about it um, there's really not much else that I've done so this is a really early on level character as well so if this counts as a let's play then that's cool with me too All right, we made it. We go to the commercial district because we need to purchase some dried apples. And he's right across the way. Let's see, you got dried apples for me. Oh, we got sausage too. Okay, and cattle. I uh, wonder who has the cattle up book because that might be something I might want to do. All right, so dried apples can't buy that many. What kind of good is it? Is it a luxury good? Yeah, I don't. Oh yeah, I, don't, I don't have purchase orders for that. So I'll have to buy craft craft up the food we want and then uh, come back and do it again. Because it's one for one on all things here. So we should get about 23 of them if we have the right amount of vigor. 24. Yeah, because there's already one stacked in here. Boom. Pork and apple saute. In production. What does that give us? 30, so only 10 more vigor, but it's a step up. Uh, we won't be using it just yet, but we'll hold on to it. Oh my god, that's getting annoying, dude. Stop. It's like he's stacking purchase orders or something. 
This is a shopkeeper here. I have cattle processing. It'd be too easy if he did. No, yeah, of course not. Didn't think so. All right. Well, that's okay. We could just port hop and come back. We might just, uh, what's the closest port? Closest port is probably Le Havre right across the way here, so we'll just go there, see what they got. Le Havre, alright, survey, caution, frugality. I usually generally use the same things. Well, I need to grind my fishing skill one of these days and just sit at the outside of a port with nothing but food and water on me and just grind catching fish and then procure, uh, not procuring, but pr uh, turning them into fish with my storage skill. Um, but that's okay. Right now, right now, that's not my goal. I want to finish making up the rest of my pigs. Um, I may probably save the rest of these pigs and turn it to pork. And then some of them into lard and see what I end up doing because I have exactly enough pork and lard to make 31 more if I can get another stack of these dried apples. I don't know. I've been to this before, but I think I stopped in to see what they sell. Do you sell cattle? No. Let's see. Raisins, butter, and flax. I'd have no idea which one of these I would be able to buy and sell at a good price. None of these are all oh, that's foodstuffs, but it's not gonna go for a high price. Let's just buy the flax because it's a low price. We'll sell that as we go back. turn the rest of the pigs into pork if I can. Okay. Alright. So Plenty of pork. Well, I didn't even realize there was like a chunk of land sticking out here before. Holy crap. Don't hurt. Ah, oh, yes. Okay. Back to the commercial district. Okay. Bye. Dried apples. We got less than we did last time. Can we sell the flax? We can at a higher price too. Nearly double. Well, before we do that, let's just say flax. We go cheap. Whoa, we go more expensive than Nantes, but Nantes ain't close. Nantes is around the peninsula there, so we, we're not going to do that. No way. We'll take the profit though. Well, oh, got some trade fame for that one. Why? Because it's gaining more popularity? I don't, I don't know what that means. Cod like fish that have its South American waters. Yeah, we're not going to be getting cod anytime soon. Um, Alright, so let's see. Livestock, makeable meats, pork and apple saute. We need a few more large too. It's a pretty even split. 
Well, not quite, but it'll be good enough when I come back and buy more. We're going to go to London this time. Actually, no, that was a pretty good profit setting to uh, Nantes, so we're going to go back to Nantes. No, sorry, not Nantes. Le Havre. And get what we want. It's Nantes that would give us a better profit, probably, unless if it also sells that, and it's just selling for a high price there. But I don't know. Got to keep an eye out for those rare goods. Occasionally you'll pop up at a place where you buy something and then go to another place and it's like worth a thousand percent more. Like not just double, not 100% or 200%, but like a thousand percent. So those you got to look out for. I had that happen to me the other day where I was in uh, Northern Africa at Sueta and I bought jute and only had to sail across the Mediterranean to the closest city of Malaga and sell it for a virtually a 1500% increase. So, those are the places you want to look for. Alright, we're back in uh, Le Havre. And we're going to go back to the market. We're going to buy. We'll buy more of that flax. The cheaper I can get it, the better. Huh, whatever. Screw you, pal. Take a mom flax with me to another city. Back to Calais. Hopefully they give me enough to handle it. To be able to cook the rest. Otherwise I'll just sell whatever I have left. So this is generally what I do on a regular basis with this character. I I like to do food stealing. I like to do uh, a lot of food sales and creating of food. Now it's not as profitable as, profitable as it used to be in the past. Not that this food would go for very much. These are very low foods. What people want is like the tuna steaks and other higher level to, uh, f foods that restore vigor and also some sailor fatigue. Um, but this is uh, what I like to do early on, get these levels up. Um, I could sell some food if I really wanted to, to make people have a little bit of something, especially new guys. Or I just give it away. I mean, honestly, I'm not trying to make money in, in large amounts. I'll, I'll probably get there at some point, plus people gave me a lot of money to get started. But in the meantime, this is just a little, little something to keep me busy, traveling back and forth between the uh, pig city of Pharaoh and then up to here to get some dried apples and only having to do this back and forth a couple times. So look at that. I think we might have exactly enough. Yep, we have exactly enough to do the last of it. Makeable meats. Pork and apple saute and we can do the last of it. Cool. And we got a lot of it out of it too. I only did 20 and I got 46 out of them so that's a good deal. And we could sell him the lard and the flax. Sold some trade goods. 40 trade experience. We're not going to get quite a lot yet. Um, we have a ways to go. Oh yeah. We have a ways, ways, ways to go. So that's why I'm thinking what I might do is just stack. Go back down to East Asia. And, or go back down to Seville. Or maybe even London will have some of the foreign trade goods that are some that are high in demand here. And uh, be able to get them for maximum. EA trade. Forgot these bars were shaped differently than the other areas. Well, Cognac is high. I'm a Boobies. 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 That's good enough. Oh, I should probably heal the fatigue. I hate the top down view here. That happened. Okay. Let's go to. Let's do a port hop. We'll go to. I've never been to Edinburgh. It's so far, but I should probably go up there and get the ports. I got most of these. I stopped thinking I'd grown engine. I haven't gotten any of Germany or any of these yet, and I'm just I don't think I'm ready for that. But I'm I could at least go to Edinburgh and see what I can get from up there. Of 
go to Edinburgh and then maybe Dublin which might be faster to go around the northern section I don't know that could be that could be a risk ask in chat to see if it's even safe to do that because I have no idea if that would be something I could pull off this early on in the game I could probably ask this in world chat is it safe for an early level sailor like myself to sail from Edinburgh, whatever it is, Eden, Edinburgh. To Dublin around the top of the island, British island. <laughs> that they seem to suggest that it might be better to go that way, um, or that it's not that it's better that it's a good way to go. You can do it. Um, just want to be, it seems like it's short to get to Dublin that way. I don't want to. I don't want to take the long way back around the bottom of the island to go back up around the top of the uh, underneath, back up to the middle. So this is a good chance to get like some northern. Uh, uh, Alcohols too. Not that I'm an alcohol trader. I don't think I have any alcohol trading at all. Um, no, yeah, I have sundries trading. Livestock. I don't know what sundries are. Miscellaneous goods that can be bought at the market. Just miscellaneous. Okay. Suggest that the Baltics are dangerous for beginners, and yeah, that's like Europe, yeah, Northern Europe. It's like Kolkata, Stockholm, Riga, Visby, Danzig, Lubeck, Copenhagen, Bergen, and Oslo. Everyone in this game is really good at helping and being honest for people. Nobody's really all that mean. I mean, there's pirates in the game too, where people like doing, but they don't bother. Um, or that they, they attack PvP, but it's not everybody. It's not my city. No, that's not my city. Oh, back hurts. Ooh, at least my ship is pretty fast for what it is. Going 7.71 knots using the GVO Navish experience here. There's Edinburgh. I think the next video that I make, I'll, I'll get that GVO Navish up on the screen so you guys can see it too. Um, I have it set at the bottom of my screen as I play, but uh, it's not like in the way, and I'll probably put it up on your screen guy for you guys too, for you to see. We're almost there. Okay, 
we made it to Edinburgh, which means we'll probably get some special goods here. Okay, oh, you know what I should be doing? I have some increases fame. That's not that important. Maybe use that before I go to do my East Asian stuff. But I have this extra experience for five hours. Seems to be the only thing I got. I thought I had more than that. I thought I had like the the speed things, but I guess I don't. That's fine. I'll take the extra experience for five hours. <coughs> Whiskey. Sheep. Cattle. Not anything I really want, but especially at the price that whiskey is, I might regret this. Who knows? Cattle could be cool. You, Mada. What do you want? They're talking about southern seas of whatever this kind of fish is. Let's check the item shop, make sure. Snap block rifle, cool. Spear training application. Nope, okay. So that's all we got here. Alright, I've never done this before. It was the furthest north I've ever been. Let's give it a shot. When we get there, maybe we'll call that the end of this episode. Uh, it looks like we're already... Does this have a timestamp of my episode on my stream here? No, it's the one thing I don't realize. I guess i got to keep a separate... Uh, timestamp going so I know exactly what's happening. All right. Hmm. <sighs> don't know what's up here. It doesn't seem like there's any cities or towns up this way. Oh shoot, there is one up there, the Northwest Passage that they added. Wow, they really did add. I'm looking at the GVO Navish and they really do have like a Northwest Passage now. They added it to the game it looks like and there is no way you're going to make trips if you don't have a fast enough ship. Whew. Nanjik and Mangazaya is like all they have for cities. That's it. That's all they got. So, and it's like the entire tr stretch of Russia. Oh, caution level one up. That's good. But yeah, that's if that's all they got, then there's like no chance that anyone will ever... Uh, There's like nothing. It's crazy what they added to this game in my time that I've been gone. I played this game ten years ago and I haven't seen much of it since.
think I could have gotten beer in one of those other cities, but I don't know that if Ireland has more. So, or different kinds. I think I need to go get my phone. Alrighty. The phone was on charge. Got to 71%. Pretty good. A lot of random shits, sh ships up here. I gotta watch what I say on the internet. A lot of random ships up here that I don't... Yep, that's exactly what I was concerned about. Caution did not work here. Escape! You said it's safe. I, it's not something that I can handle in my little tiny ship. Those are worse than... The last, uh... Maritime quest. Safe enough, I guess. That's why you have the escape uh, ability. I want to get my maritime skill up, but it's not going to be battling those guys, that's for sure. It's battling these guys. <laughs> that's what's going to get me up there in skill. please. Anybody I know online? No, not today. Set my status. I have no idea what half that stuff means. I'm still a noob myself to some degree. I have a general idea. when I'm on my long, long, long trips, but I like this one for storage. Disguise level? Yeah, you're right. What am I doing with that? I should be using this when traveling. This is for when I'm actually doing my storage skill. I don't even have jewelry trading and art trading, but if I did, this would be useful. Dublin. Let's see what sort of trade fame I get. No, it's not trade fame. Adventure experience I get now that I got this uh, special item effect giving me fixed experience for a period of time. Never been to Dublin before. Hey, look, it's me. It's Victor. Selling a lot of that stuff. I don't know. We will sell cattle, sure. For a small profit. We can buy. Well, more pork, bacon. This is like literally everything I make. Why would I buy any of this? Guess I'll buy more whiskey. Uh, 
all this is stuff literally that I make. I don't know. This could be a bad choice. Uh, buy, but well, I hope uh, this learns your lessons, everybody. There's nothing in Dublin to buy. <laughs> Everything, at least if you're me and you're doing all this trading, is whiskey only, and even then, I'm not even sure that this will be a positive uh, experience for me in the, in the long run. I guess you guys are all dying to find out, so we're gonna. Oh, can we do auto navigation? Mm -hmm. Can we get to. See, I don't want to go to Lisbon, I want to go to Seville, because that's my... So you can't let a battle occurs along the way, are you sure? It's going to cost me 35 tow permits? Frick that! Or is that how much I... I don't know. I've never done this before. I don't, kind of don't want to. I'm just going to sail it. It's a safe enough sail as it is. We got 15 days worth. I got frugality. Frugality is already rank three. You know that's going to reduce any amount of use that we get. do much video editing but it may be plausible in this game to do some video editing between sailing points because I have a feeling this is going to get old for you guys. This will be the last one where you guys will have a full sailing trip uh, involved. If I don't edit out the sailing trip completely I will fast forward it um, for the sake of traveling and still you guys seeing the general route in case you guys are curious on how I get to and from places. Like, there isn't much in this game, like, landmarks-wise, or anything that where you can really truly understand where you are. Like, you don't have, like, any sort of reference point in this. I mean, the land looks black, and the cities look black, and the water is just open, and there are boats randomly going by. I don't know how this guy is leading a whole crew in a sloop, and he's got a guy who has a better boat than he does. I have no idea. But... Uh oh, there better not be maintenance today, otherwise this is going to cut this stuff, a video short. Seems like we're going to make it, and this will take us so pretty much the whole straight shot. We don't even need to really angle ourselves. So this will put us just to the right of Gijon in northern France, or northern Spain. So if we can angle ourselves just right, this will put us right in the right spot. It's like it can't make up its mind. It's a big change if I go more right. But if it puts me right at the Gijon, then I know I've got the safe shot. Like I'm using GVO Navish right now to kind of like angle my boat straight towards Gijon. That seems to be the right path right there. It puts me just to the west of Gijon, and if I need to hit it, I can pull in. If not, I will stop right at it. But. This is like the perfect pathway. Mm. 43 whiskey that I don't remember how much I bought it for, but... Did anyone say there was maintenance today? It's today at 2 p.m. Oh. Today, oh boy, at 2 p.m. server time? How do I know what the server time is? Where 
where do I see the current server time? Because that's what I would like to know. I mean, if it happens in an hour, that would be 1 p.m. or sorry, 2 p.m. Eastern time, so it would be exactly. Well, all these numbers are flying. They're saying 10 a.m. server time right now. I'm seeing it 2 p.m. right now. It's in an hour. This person says starts in one hour and ends in three hours, I think. So in four hours, 2 p.m. Eastern time. So one hour. <laughs> I don't know what maintenance server 2 p.m. Eastern is one hour from now. Yeah. It's about 67 minutes, 64 minutes. What? What the? I don't understand. This is confusing. Oh, I do have. Oh, no, I don't. Yeah, I do. Speed. There we go. Yeah, I guess it didn't show me in any other way. Cease fire, uh, avoid battles for 30 minutes except for special battles. I got good stuff here. I guess I didn't see it when I was in person. Got unfinished maps I might attempt to do at some point. Coast of Lisbon, off the coast of Calvi, north of Lisbon. This one I got a shipwreck. Oh, these are shipwreck maps. I want to get rid of those. Oh, I see light, which means we are getting close to the northern portion of Spain, of Gijon, which I'm pretty sure there's pork here if everyone wanted to buy more pork, but I've made a lot of the other kind of food. Yeah, I'm, I'm fine. Think about it, it's going to go one-third farther than the current food that I'm using, and I've used about 40 in the last hour that we've been playing maybe I don't even know exactly how long the stream is going to be we're still good on food for 11 more days I'll click they can't decide if it's 2 p.m. server time and if it is 2 p.m. server time it's eastern standard time or it's, p or it's pacific what's What do you mean seven days? <laughs> People are like worried that it's gonna go down for seven days. I can't play this game for seven days. Like I don't play other games. People, come on. If this is the only game you play. Then I can't imagine how far in this game it would be. When I was twenty, I had all the time in the world in the summer to play this. I think I played it for the entire summer, and I still didn't get patch past much farther than where I am even right now. But I wasn't playing very efficiently, and now I'm playing more efficiently, and I'm pretty much three days in, and this is where I'm at, and I'm at these character information levels. So. People are all mad about the server maintenance. I'm not. I'm just going to drop this stuff off, see if I get anything for this in, in Lisbon or Seville. I think we're going to go to Seville just because it's my home city. And then we're going to buy some East Asia Indian goods while I still have some other goodies. My friend wanted to play another game today. I don't know that he will. Oh, he just texted me. He said he could do games at 3. Well, look at that. I got more time. You got it. But he wanted to play some Minecraft today. So we will just have to wait until 3 o'clock, which means I get more time with you guys. Unless if the server is cut short. Let's see, just sort of salvaging the server to go down.
I just had to straight up ask because it seems like everyone's all up in the air about this. Everyone's saying PST. All right, so that means it's way more time. Way more time. All right, that's good. People are all getting salty as hell. That's funny. <laughs> wow, we're hitting eight knots. It's the fastest I think I've ever hit. Tetris. Yep, agreed. Play something better. <laughs> Probably finish my exams. Whew. People. So glad I graduated. Alright, looks like I made it to Seville. The music in Seville is so good. Alright. Cheap East India. Goods, huh? Really? Ooh, 31 on the spice. People are going really well. Whiskey did get me a hundred dollar profit, so that's that's kind of nice. Hey, come on. Fine. You don't get it if I can't successfully haggle. attempt to sell this stuff. I'll make a small profit off of that and a decent profit off of this. Wow, we just got 800 experience out of that. 72 trade. Fame for it too. So what did that leave us with this? I need to do that like 12 more times. Well, we're going to buy some more of your stuff, my friend. Sixty trade fame. Five twenty two experience. Wow. So if I get five hundred like that, it should be a matter of time. Alright, well you know what we're gonna do? We're gonna cheat our way to level twenty. Just gonna go right to the bank. Oh look, I'm glowing red because that's what people do in games when they get high levels. It's got 40 million to his name and that many Roman coins. Let's pull 4 million out. supposed to play that wasn't I oh man I'm gonna be mad experience increase so that's good 
endorsement still for another few minutes ship speed increase yeah I was supposed to do the fame increase too well it's alright 30% more would have been like another 15 to 20 I'm gonna keep buying from you my friend Anybody else have anything else other than those two? No. It seems to be that's that's the spice that people are selling. Why don't you put your price up? Yeah, you're not gonna sell any at that rate, buddy. I'd rather sell spices. And I'll check. You're not that cheap. Spend a thousand less. Ten thousand total fame. All right, I'm gonna read that all again. Large well, special product to yield a profit. Nutmeg seems to be gaining even more popularity. Seems to be getting more popularity. Trade is now. Wow, I skipped a lot of levels. All right, so we're gonna sell more. Until all four million of you is gone. So, yep, I got to level 20. You can now hire an aide. That's all I wanted to do. Thank you for your patronage. That was my main goal. You say EA Chief, are you lying? No, you're not. You're lying. Everybody wants these 18 Master Carronades. I just need 8 Master Carronades. Nah, I can't afford them now. Alright. I need to go to Lisbon to get my aid that I want now. Well, I was going to end this episode early, but now I'm thinking, no. Well, yes, we will. This is where we'll stop. we got to see if this will all fit on my computer. All right, everybody, thanks for coming and watching me hit level 20. Uh, next time you'll see me get an aid and maybe start earning up some uh, experience with that aid and making some more cooking goods. All right, everybody, take it easy and sayonara.